Hi guys! Well, we made a decision. There's going to be another doggy, and uh, her name is going to be Tina. This is what she looks like. And she's adorably cute, isn't she? Uh, she comes from Spain. Why from Spain? Why not a doggy from the Netherlands? Well, first of all, uh, I, I have to be honest, there's about 180 dogs in the shelter right now. And when I filtered through that that they had to get along with a cat and that they had to be a girl and that they can't be any older than like two years. Uh, there were like two dogs left and f those basically were already up for adoption. So, so uh, after a long search I, uh, I bumped into something called uh, Animals Without Borders and uh, there I found a little girl that was about uh, that's that's still fairly young. Uh, I I don't know what she will be like. I don't even know if uh, if she knows how to poop outside or anything. But anyway, uh, the 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 costs for this is are pretty high, and it wouldn't have been a problem if if I didn't have uh, received COVID. Well, that's what you get. You work with refugees. Uh, they are untested, they come in with the COVID and uh, yes, I work with them. So the, the, the chances are fairly high that one will sneeze and I will get it. So, but I am, don't worry about me guys. I am very healthy. I, I am not on any medication. Uh, I, I'm completely healthy um, and my immune system can take care of business very well so but the other the problem is uh, I might be running a little short of funds and I do want to get this girl so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a 50% discount on my Etsy patterns there were some people that asked me for it anyway after uh, last year after the um, the Black Friday sale uh, they were kind of late to the party so I hope uh, that here's your second chance and I hope to, uh, that you will buy some patterns for half the price and that way help me fund getting my girl, uh, our new girl, uh, over here to the Netherlands and um, making sure that uh, she lacks for nothing uh, because everything is taken care of except for a little bit of the adoption money. Uh, they, the, the people from Borders, uh, uh, Animals Without Borders, they want you to buy a certain kind of leash, uh, so that has to be bought as uh, upon her arrival. And I need some uh, travel money, but I think uh, that will be the least of the problems because that's about 50 euros traveling up and down to pick her up and bring her home. Of course, you will be the first ones to see her when she arrives. She's going to arrive on the 12th and I'm hoping to have a little video up uh, when she arrives. And uh, she's probably going to be very tired because uh, they are not allowed to go with the with the planes anymore. Uh, so they uh, she's coming uh, from Spain with a, a car with a car. So, uh, but anyway, uh, fifty percent discount on my Etsy page if you want to help me uh, fund the uh, the adoption of Tina and. Um, uh, I'm gonna leave that up until the 12th and make sure that whatever money uh, I get from that is uh, indeed used uh, for her and uh, other than that I still have most of my stuff from Kira uh, everything has been washed so I hope her scent is out of everything and that Tina will accept um, the blankets and and all that kind of stuff that Kira used to lay on uh, so in advance thank you guys if you wanted to help me and I will see you back on the 12th with a little video of Tina no doubt of her arrival and all that stuff okay see you guys bye